My name is Andrew, and here is my story. Some years ago, I had my encounter with the Lord Jesus. I understood the importance of baptism and so I got baptized in water and was prayed for to receive the Holy Spirit. My born again experience was celebrated. I was told that now, I am born again and saved, I am now a Christian. But what did that mean? Born again for what? Saved from what? And as a Christian do I identify with everyone who claims to be a Christian? I was not told what I was born again for. Though I understood that I was saved from hell, but could not identify with every other Christian because of different belief systems within the religion of Christianity. It was all very confusing. A study of the scriptures revealed what we are born again for. Not just to be saved from hell, or to become a Christian. The Lord Jesus is clear that when one gets born again by water and spirit baptism, they enter into the kingdom of God, a realm where God is king over their lives, and rules them from within. This is what it says. Jesus answered, Very truly I tell you, no one can enter the kingdom of God unless they are born of water and the spirit. When one enters the kingdom of God, they must change their whole paradigm. That is their mindset. Their life must prioritize and be governed by only two major principles. They must now seek first the kingdom of God. That is fulfilling Matthew 28, 19, which is to go make other disciples or citizens of the kingdom of God wherever they are. And seek first also the king's righteousness by a continuous life of fellowship with Holy Spirit. For the kingdom is righteousness, peace and joy in the Holy Spirit. And the king promises in his word to provide for you and protect you. That is take up the responsibility of his kingdom and live righteously through the Holy Spirit. And he takes up the responsibility to provide and protect you. That is life simplified for you and me. Be blessed.